I think the whole overpopulation it's thing is rubbish. Like, mm, yeah, yeah, that's not true. <laughs> yeah, but, but why do so many uh, otherwise smart people buy buy into that? Well, I think to some degree this is a side effect of the environmental movement. Okay, you know, so uh, you know the sort of environmental movement I think started off well, where it was um, saying, "Look, we need to move to sustainable energy." Uh, which is, is correct in the long term. We do need to move to sustainable energy. It's, it's tautological. If we don't move to sustainable energy, then it's unsustainable and we'll run out and civilization will grind to a halt. So we do need to have sustainable energy over time. Uh, there's obviously a concern with, the, with climate change. Um, although like, I'm of the opinion that while there is a long-term concern for climate change, there, there is not really much of a short-term concern. Like mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's a very slow process. Um, and I think we don't, we don't need to sort of be um, stopping people from farming or having cows or, or, or whatever. Like, this is crazy. This is, the, 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 and, and that's like small potatoes from an environmental standpoint. The, 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 really, the, 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 the fundamental thing from an environmental standpoint is if, if you've got billions of tons of um, fossil fuels, essentially, uh, you know, uh, carbon in liquid and gaseous form or solid form in the case of coal, that's buried deep underground, and you move it from deep underground into the into the atmosphere and the oceans. You obviously change the chemistry of the of the oceans and atmosphere. Mm. And if you keep doing that for a long time, we'll eventually change the chemistry enough that there will indeed be climate change. Um, but Earth is very big, and human and humans for, are, are small. Mm. <laughs> I mean, uh, Tim Urban, I calculated that you could fit all the humans on Earth um, on one floor in the city of New York. On one floor. On one floor. Yes. Now you've kind of wedged in there, but yeah. you know, but uh, oh, okay. So if you just kind of spread the like, well, throughout like the city, okay, shoulder to shoulder, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. whatever. Okay. It's it's a like basically the cross like the cross sectional area of humans is small. Like mm -hmm. we think that there are a lot of people, but and that's if you live in like London or New York, you'd be like, oh wow, there's a lot of people. But this is that's a very rare situation. Mm -hmm. Most of the time, you know, if you're if you're flying, um, you know across the U.S. or internationally, it's empty. It's empty. <laughs> it's empty. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you yeah. fly from LA to New York, most of the time there's like, you don't see anyone. No. Yeah. So, um, yeah. So like if, if, if you're, if you're trying to drop a ball on somebody's head while flying from LA to New York, <laughs> you'd have a real hard time. You know, you're going to miss. Uh, it's just not a, you know, we, we, we humans are not densely packed. They're, mm -hmm. Um, so yeah, um, plenty, well, plenty of room for more people is basically the situation. In the limit of environmentalism, you, you start to conclude that humanity is a plague on, on earth, mm, that humanity is actually the problem. That's a big one. Yeah. And, um, that's like obviously taking the environmental movement just too far, mm -hmm. but there are literally people who believe this. They're like extinctionists. Yes. Um, the New York times as some months ago had an article um, front page article with with some guy who, and, and his quote was, "There are eight billion on people on Earth, and it would be better if there were none." That's dark. Yeah, it's I'm really like, dark. hey, buddy, you can start with yourself. Yeah. You know, yeah, no, see if you really want to, <laughs> you know, make a difference. So, but yeah. uh, you know, take your own advice here. Um, but it, but that that's like a crazy viewpoint. You know, that's like literally saying, "Let's genocide humanity." Mm -hmm. I'm like, what? <laughs> How can you say that with a straight face? That's like total madness.